Uh, well, I mean, we do give a lot of, uh, well, we, we know how we feel about the, the Bay movies, but I will give, like, like you were saying, um, I will give them credit because the 07 movie was the one that got me into Transformers. And, like, it was, you know, the connection between the humans and the robots was what sparked my interest. And then, so my friend and I went and we watched, we, we tracked down the 80s cartoon and we're like, admittedly came into it thinking, oh, we'll, we'll go and find the 80s cartoon and it's probably going to be silly and we'll just, you know, have a good time looking at it and just fell in love. I mean, it, that, it, the, you got, you guys got us into Transformers, really. So, I wanted to say thank you for all of that. Um, my question would be, is there a episode that was your favorite one to work on or to make or to come up with or for everybody? Word on. Yeah. Transport to Oblivion. You write that? Ooh, I wrote that, yeah. You did? Yeah. Because yeah. that, that was the first time you really got a, a, a that relationship between Bumblebee yeah, sure. and Spike. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I always yeah. liked Bumblebee. Um, I always thought being the smallest, <laughs> he probably was the cutest. I'm glad to see he got his own movie. <laughs> was Bumblebee was kind of foregrounded in uh, Attack of the Autobots, wasn't he? Was it that or was it... No. Yeah, because I remember cause Attack of the Autobots was my first episode. And I remember you know, going through the phone book list of all the characters in the show. And going, well, this Bumblebee guy is really interesting because he's the underdog and sort of this queen and everything seriously. In my recollection, I haven't seen the episode forever. Can anybody tell me? Does that, did, my recollection is that I, I sort of led with him. Am I right? Or? He, had a lot, he had a lot to do with it, but, you know, I think, in my opinion, of that episode, Bumblebee was a lot of emotional things because of the whole form of the doctor. Right. Because the doctor was saying, you know, he couldn't believe that. that right. But isn't it Bumblebee who kind of like is the one guy who saves all the Autobots? Yes. Yeah. 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 yeah, that's, yeah, no, I was, no, so like, first thing out of the gate, I was attracted to that character because he just struck me as being more I knew I liked you right away. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know why. Now, in my now second episode, oh, <laughs> I foregrounded Perceptor. Okay, ah. so that was like, I'm, I'm like, okay, he turns into a oh, mind discussion. Okay. Nobody is doing this guy. <laughs> Give me this guy. I'll come with a reason to it. What if they shrink down? That was Microbots, where they shrunk down. Yeah, you know, well, yeah. Where famously the Decepticons all got drunk on, on <laughs> underground. Yeah. Hey, Dave, can you talk more to the microphone? The people in the back can't hear you at all. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. My favorite episode were the ones that I was in. Uh, we didn't. Do you remember the the titles of some of the episodes? Some of them, yeah. Uh, I sort of don't. I mean, it was on the front page. That's all we know. And this is just Wally saying, "Do this," you know. So, but uh, it was wonderful to do. Jerry, thank you. <laughs>